keep kids off the street, if you want to keep them educated, um, it's like a domino effect. This program in general just embodies CUNY helping people. Oh, yeah. It was incredible to be given an opportunity like this. Amazing. I can't wait to get started. Being a service corps member is about having a positive impact, being a leader, being a professional. So we're trying to appeal to a lot of the interests that you as our students have. We make New York City healthier, active the environment. That's what I would like to be focusing on. Let's keep the kids out of the streets. People who probably can't help themselves or don't know how to help themselves. What will your job be and how will you all work together? Well, each of us will be representatives for the different departments mm -hmm. within the organization. First and last name as clearly as possible. Put your name on a name tag. It'll yeah. start at 11, so in about 15 minutes. Well, a lot of thought and planning has gone into setting up this matching fair. We would ask that you give all the students who come to your table a chance to pitch themselves. Have the students make a goal. Because they're coming to you with real intention. Your project. We're so grateful to you for being a part of our community partner portfolio this year. It's a new program, so that's kind of exciting. And we're really looking forward to working closely with you. Thank you very much. The other one will be development and infrastructure, actually building new structure. CUNY Service Corps is an amazing new initiative at CUNY. It's kind of great to see the whole entire change happen. We're going to have about 850 students and uh, approximately 100 community partners who are hosting our students. The schools that are participating are the Borough of Manhattan Community College, John Jay College of Criminal Justice, College of Staten Island, Kingsborough Community College, New York City College of Technology, Queens College, and Lehman College. So we have the Tyrannosaurus Rex and we have the Apatosaurus. Students work 12 hours a week during the academic year. How do we know it was a dinosaur? While they're doing meaningful work at various community partner sites all over New York City. Of any public assistance? They're paving the way for their academic and their professional success, and they're also getting paid. Now, this is not insignificant. Instead of just locking the youth up, they, you know, make them get involved in the community. Like, you know. We have a lot of low income, a lot of first generation college students who would love to be involved in the community, but many times they can't afford it because they have to work. Having someone to show you the steps and explain it. This definitely works out to incorporate both work and service and help your community while still being able to continue to pay tuition. Drug and alcohol abuse and later in my right. And they need the health service. Right. I feel like the service corps, you know, it'll allow us to be more aware and more educated about what is going on in our city. Now, housing is an issue with how you can get the community to help out. If I ask everyone who's um, Andrew Cuomo, they'll look at me like, what if I say who's Kim Kardashian? Everybody knows, you know? <laughs> And that's not good. She teaches me like so many things. I feel like some kids do want to help, but they don't know how to. Where do we start? I'm coming. Next. This is a great opportunity for our students to be in the world, in neighborhoods, in communities, and show everyone what they have to offer. It um, also helps you become a little bit more humble. And I think one of the most important benefits of a citizenship is that you will be able to vote. You get to see what people in your community actually go through that you probably weren't aware of. Community center and then it has like the... Yeah, this, yeah. Program, this program in general, I think it's a good example for the generation coming after. They really need to see people caring for people. It seems like, you know, we're like a These are kids that keep replenishing this country. You would help with propagation, nursery management, weeding. So for us students to have this kind of rich experience and get off to great starts in the workplace, I think is absolutely important. Um, but I'm hoping also that this gives them a real understanding about public service, nonprofits, how important that kind of work is also. We did a community in providing service and bringing their skills to bear in the institutions and with the populations that these institutions serve, they are moving outside of themselves, enacting the very root of what education is about to lead out from the concerns of the individual into the broader general civic interests so important for certainly the health of the city but the health of the individual. It's actually telling us that we have the power to change. So talk to them about college life. We're not just an individual anymore. We can leave our individual worlds and actually pool our resources and talents and actually do something. You always want to feel inside that you did something, like you made a difference. It's really helpful for our students to have so much. I want to see what happens at the end. I want to know what we achieved, you know, who we helped. Yeah, you, are association. you know, I feel like servicing people is a lost art in this generation. I think that's really bad because when you focus on, you know, products or technology instead of the people behind it, 
I think you're going far away from what people are meant to be about. Hopefully people like us and programs like this can correct that. Mm -hmm.